one of the things that we do day in and day out is having more new customers on our portfolio so as a customer success manager like myself and so many others out there how do we approach building rapper with new clients um i kind of split it it's i think it's a, it's quite a logical and, and sequential so i would like me or my team to be ready and prepared so if it's a new p- person uh, or a new client i would like to understand the background uh we can get some information from sales uh proper handover from sales is usually uh, important and necessary to make sure we we know who we are going to talk with and what their expectations are you can check on linkedin uh, their people's profile that's you know the other way to do it to do it you can use your network or people that know other people to get more in uh, information uh about them so preparation i think is a key and then when we meet them if it could be the first meeting and also in, in any other meeting uh to be able to demonstrate knowledge of their environment of their challenges we mentioned proactive listening so whatever you captured in different meeting will be very good to follow up or mention in, in the following meeting so they can see that you are there to actually not just listen but to remember and act upon a, a, a certain actions or certain uh, promises that you make um i think other than the first meeting uh, which is always well, some some of it is used to uh, introduction uh we want to create from one meeting to the next some kind of hooks or follow ups and 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 maintain a certain frequent communication depending on the requirements mm-hmm. from the other person so by doing so you're making sure that you know one thing follows the next because it's a relationship it's an it's ongoing um we are not there just to do one meeting and and meet the customer the renewal usually that's going to be to fail that approach so we have as a csm needs to find those those uh, angles uh, and points where we can follow up and then we can use the follow up uh, to provide more updates reports look at certain recommendation best practices and then this is also helping to build the confidence uh, uh, with your customers and i would maybe add that sometimes we do all of that but <clears throat> sometimes we forget to seek feedback and yeah. ask the other side about is that been info- uh, helpful is this going to help you to mm-hmm. achieve your targets and your job uh, and make sure that you know you get some response and see that if you are on the right direction or maybe you need to make some changes.